generally good. How are you? It's good. I am good. I'm quite excited today. <laughs> I don't know whether it's because the sun's shining or... It or, is a beautiful day. I don't know. Day. Just, it's good. To, good day, isn't it? It is. Beautiful. Yeah. Beautiful day. What are we going to do today? Uh, we've got loads of fun. Like, um, though, I need some help finding stuff. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Then obviously we've got our straw. Oh, we have. Yes. Wonder where it's from. Um, and then we've got another game. Yeah. As well. And then um, we've got some thinking. Ooh, a bit of yes. thinking. A little bit of a, a thought, bit of should we say? Sounds good. Yeah. It's all so, good. So should we get on with the game? I think we should. Great. Okay. Let's play a game. Okay. Okay. Right. I'm game for a game. Oh, game I'm always for a game. game for a game. Shall um, we make Tabs do some running around? Oh, no. Always. <laughs> That's a great idea. <laughs> yeah. I'll, right, I'll only run around uh -huh. if those lovely people at home run around as well. Deal. You're okay. going to run around yeah. as well, yeah? Alright. Yes. Okay, so, so um, we're going to play Bring Me a Blank. I'm going to ask you for something. I'm going to say, bring me something. If I say a water bottle, you need to go and find a water bottle and bring it back. Uh, and you've got okay. to try and be quicker yeah, than right. them. Okay. Do you think tabs are quicker than them? No. <laughs> <laughs> if you Please. are at home and you're going up and down stairs, obviously be careful. Don't run yeah. up and down stairs because you might slip. Okay. You I'll might slip. You. I won't slip. So don't do that. All right. Okay. Are you ready? Yes. I am. I'm not running. Are they ready? I think they are ready. Okay, are you ready? You versus Tabs. Bring me a pen. Ooh, go find one. I think he's going to uh, get it quicker than them. Now he, are, he only uses laptops. Oh, good point. So Probably, it's, probably doesn't know where pens are. No. It's just oh, me and you. I can hear him. Pens. <laughs> <laughs> I like a pen. I've got a notebook. I know, I've got a notebook. Different colours. Come on, Tabs. They're probably doing oh. really well. A pen! Hey! He's got a pen. It's from Click Sergeant. Oh, nice. And Children's Cancer Charity. Very good. Winner. Well yeah. done. Yeah. Did you there do you it go. quicker than Tabs? Some of them did. Uh, no, they didn't. I think probably most. Okay. Are you ready? Yeah, I'm ready. I'm not doing it, but yeah. Are you ready to make him do it? Oh yeah, Tefo. Right. Okay. A little bit out of breath. But... Well, tough. Bring me a shoe. <gasps> oh, you you like shoes, don't you? Oh, I love shoes. I like trainers. Trainers. I like comfy trainers. At the mm. moment, I really like white trainers, but then they get dirty. To be fair, are you wearing trainers a lot at the moment? At the moment, I'm wearing a lot of slippers. Yeah, we are. Yeah, we are. Right now, oh. I'm wearing slippers. <laughs> Way. Oh, I'm not quite sure. It's got a shoe. Classic a tabs, shoe. black leather converse. It is a shoe. A shoe slash trainer. They might have got a trainer. Yeah. Any type of shoe will do. <laughs> Rhymed. I wore those well on done. my wedding day. Oh, so true. it's definitely a shoe. Smelly shoe. Lost it that long. Yeah. Woo! Smelly. Oh, it's alright. <laughs> is yours smelly? Oh, good. Theirs isn't either. Okay, are you ready? Next one. Yes. Right. Bring me. Some toothpaste. Oh, okay. Yeah. Well, will you know where that is? Because sometimes he's got very <laughs> rude. Very Nasty. rude. Like at the moment, we're, we're washing our hands a lot. We also need to remember to brush our teeth because we're with people at home a lot. Got some you know. toothpaste. Hey! Yeah. Did you scrunch it up on the way? Um. Yeah. You can't see what brand it is. <laughs> <laughs> got some toothpaste. Well yeah. done. Did you do it quicker than tabs? Right, he's now getting a bit out of breath, so okay. let's do another one because you might beat him on this one. Okay. Bring me a spoon. A oh. spoon! Spoon! I'm saying it because it's the furthest away <laughs> thing in the house. <laughs> oh. right. What's your favourite no, spoon? There's one just there. Oh, yeah, there is. It's a dirty spoon. Oh, I mean, it's still a spoon. From Tabs as Cocoa Pops. But yeah. What's, what did what's you your favourite spoon? Can I spoon? <laughs> Like, I'm, I'm a fan of teaspoons. I like a little spoon. Yeah. Like, if I'm eating something. I'm more of a soup spoon person, mate. Soup spoon. Yeah. Super. Super. <laughs> hey! It's a soup spoon! It's a soup spoon! Oh, it's Emily's favourite type of spoon. Is it? You can have that spoon. Yeah, oh, thank there you. you. Go. Well, well done. Nice one. 
Yeah. Okay, do you want any more? Yes! He does? Go on, one right, more, should we go one more? Let's go one more. Okay. okay. Bring me... A game. A game? Some sort of game. Oh. Any game. Could be a board game. Could be. Could be a video game. Could be a card game. Could be a card game, you're right. Yeah. Loads of games. Loads of games. It could be this game. This game. How would you bring that? Just like, ta-da! Yeah, yeah, you can try that. <laughs> we'll see, see how that goes. Um, yeah, hopefully you're finding a game right now. Go, go, go! Oh, this, Quick, come way. back! You can play spoons! Spoons! They might not play spoons. Oh, don't, it's quite dangerous. a good game. It's fun. Oh, oh, I can hear him. Have you done it quicker than Tabs? He's nearly here. Well done. Well done. Hey. He's got a game. Just one ligretto. Okay, you can stop now. Play it with me. Great. Did you beat Tabs? <laughs> On some of them they did, but did you they? did really well. Thank you. you really quick. Thanks. You did all right, didn't you? Thanks very much, everyone. Thank you. <laughs> well, hopefully you enjoyed that. What time is it? It's story time! Yes, it is indeed. We have a really cool story for you today. Okay, what's it called? It's called Come and Follow Me. I'll always follow you. Woo! Okay. Depends where. That's true. Not to some places, because yeah, that's, that's just weird. Mm. But, um, do you want to hear it? Of course I do. Okay, do you want to hear it? Oh, good. Yeah. Phew! Okay. Brother one, brother two, fishing in the sea. Brother three, brother four, come and follow me. Jesus walked along the shore, the shore of Galilee, and there he saw two brothers fishing in the sea. Leave your nets, said Jesus. Leave them, let them be. Come and fish for people. Come and follow me. Brother one, brother two, fishing in the sea. Brother three, brother four, come and follow me. So Simon left his nets behind, left them by the sea. Andrew did the same and shouted, hang on, wait for me. Then off they went with Jesus on the shores of Galilee, and there they met some other brothers fishing in the sea. Brother one, brother two, fishing in the sea. Brother three, brother four, come and follow me. Those brothers were called James and John, the sons of Zebedee. And Jesus said to them as well, come and follow me. Like that, they left their father, surprised as he could be, and left their nets behind as well, sitting in the sea. Brother one, brother two, fishing in the sea. Brother three, brother four, come and follow me. Oh, that's a good story, that, isn't yeah. it? About some brothers. About some brothers, about some fishing. Yeah. You know, but actually, the most important bit is Jesus saying, come and follow me. True. <laughs> Okay, do you want to play a game? Always. Yes, I've got my breath back. I am, <laughs> I am game for another game. Good. Winner. So, this game is about following my instructions. Oh, okay. Because the story uh -huh. was about uh -huh. following. Yeah, yeah. So you're going to follow what I say. Okay. So if I say, do this hmm. with an action, then you do the action. Okay. okay? And uh, you carry simple. on yeah. doing the action until I say, do this about something else, oh, and then you copy my action. However, if I say do that with an action, yeah. you don't do it. Oh, sorry. So do this, you do it, carry on your action until I say do this again. But if I say do that, you don't do it. You don't do it. Go okay, on. do we understand? Thumbs up if we understand. Brilliant. Okay, are you ready? Uh, born ready, yes. Good. So, do this. Do that. No, you don't. Didn't catch me. Do out. this. Do this. Oh. Mm. Do that. Oh, oh time yeah. you not doing it. Oh, yeah. Do this. Oh, I'm out. Keep going, keep going anyway. Oh, can do I keep that, going? you oh, can okay. keep going. Oh. 
Oh, Nearly at your you face. <laughs> Do this. Oh. Do that. Nope. Tab. Oh, oh, <laughs> <that was good. laughs> Do this. Can I keep going? Keep going. Oh, cool. Do that. Oh, I did it. No. Oh. No. Oh, oh. Do this. Oh. Oh. Uh, do that. Do nope. swim. No, don't do that. Because I that. said do that. <laughs> do this. Bit of whatever that is. Do that. Oh, oh glad you didn't do it. I do this. Oh, we like this one. Do this. You should start like a dance video. Uh -huh. Do that. No. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> oh. You did all right. I did. I'm not However, like rubbish. Um, less good, but that's okay because it's just a game, and you know, doesn't matter if you're out because you still get to join in. Yeah. How did you do? Fun. They did all right. Yeah. Well they done. They did all everyone. right. Quite tricky. Let's well give done. yourselves and them a big round of applause. <laughs> well done. Okay, last week Hetty spoke about what is true and what is false. And now we have a decision to make about being on Jesus' team and looking at like the evidence that's there and going, is it true or is it false? So we make that decision as to whether we're to be on his team. But I'm gonna talk about the first team that Jesus decided upon, which we know to be his disciples. So in sport, okay, netball, love it. But there's always that moment in which everyone is standing against the wall and you have two captains out in front and they have to pick the team. Now, obviously, you're going to pick the best players first because you want the best team. And netball, I was okay, so I thought, do you know what, I'm gonna be picked like one of the first times, that would be great. And I normally was, because I was a really good player, let's be honest. But when it came to hockey, I knew for a fact I was always going to be the last person picked. Now, with Jesus' disciples, you kind of would have thought that Jesus would have picked these amazing scholars and teachers and people of influence within society. But actually, Jesus flips it and he chose basically the nobodies, the people that they didn't want to hang out with, like fishermen, they stank. Okay, tax collectors, they robbed people of money. No one wanted to hang around these people, yet Jesus was saying, come and follow me, come and be my friend. Now when he was saying, come and follow me, it wasn't like he was saying, oh, let's hang out this afternoon and we'll have a great time chilling on the beach. No, when he said, come and follow me, he meant, actually, I want you to follow me with everything. So there has to be a willingness in that. Now, there's two aspects of willingness within this. The first one is actually, they had to be willing to follow Jesus. Basically, go wherever he was going. And this, they didn't know how long that this was going to be for, when we know that it's for three years that they physically followed him. And then for the rest of their lives, they followed him in his teachings and his ways and his purpose. So they had to leave everything behind, which was their jobs, their families, like everything to follow him. Now, this is not a small thing to do or to kind of leave behind. It was a big cost and we have to make that decision too. There are some things that we're gonna have to drop to follow Jesus. So the first aspect of willingness is to follow Jesus. And the second one is to follow in action. So to do what Jesus has taught us to do, to do what Jesus asks us to do. And 
model our lives upon Jesus. Now when Jesus went to those disciples and says, come and follow me, didn't finish there. He said, come and follow me and fish for men. And so the good news that we've been talking about for the past couple of weeks, actually, we shouldn't be keeping to ourselves. We should be sharing it with everyone that we know because we've decided whether we're to be on Jesus's team. But actually, Jesus doesn't just pick us. He picks everyone. He calls us by name, but he calls everyone by name. He wants everyone on his team. And we have an amazing, amazing role to play, which is to share the good news of Jesus, to share the love that we know that we have from him, to share the fact that we know that he's with us all the time, that he thinks we're epic, that he thinks we're his masterpiece, that we're awesome. We're to share that with others and say, do you know what? Jesus thinks you're epic, you're amazing, you're his masterpiece. We're to share the love that he has for them because this love is too big for us to keep it to ourselves. Actually, we want to share it with everyone so everyone gets to hear the good news of Jesus. So my challenge to you is this. Who are you going to share the good news of Jesus to? So we're just gonna have a moment of quiet where I'm gonna just ask the Holy Spirit to give you a name of a person that you know that you're to share the good news of Jesus about. So we're just gonna close our eyes so we don't get distracted by what's happening around us and a name will come to mind. And that will be the name of the person that you're to share the good news of Jesus with. So let's just close our eyes. Holy Spirit, I pray that you come. And I pray that you will give us a name of someone that we should share the good news of Jesus the good news of the love that you have for them, that you call them by name. So we ask now, will you give us that name? And I ask that you help us to share that good news and help us to speak the right words and give us the courage and boldness to do so. Amen. It has been great that you have been with us this time. What have you enjoyed? Um, I've enjoyed making tabs from around. Yes, that was fun. That was fun because I made him go to <laughs> further places in the house on purpose. He got a <laughs> sweat on. Um, but I also enjoyed that our story linked to last week yes. and how we looked at we can choose to follow Jesus yeah. and this week people chose to follow Jesus but also we talked about how we get to share that with others if we want to yeah so that was kind of cool yeah so you need to remember the challenge that has been set for you and we will see you next time, time. bye see ya.